So yeah, we're here day three, Timmy Wiegand, Dexter Abbott, we're uh, hanging out, getting our bikes tomorrow. The rest of the team uh, got their bikes checked in. Destry and Timmy are still waiting on bikes, so hopefully they get them, uh, not today, tomorrow, and they still have time to encounter just before the race starts, so I think that'll be fine. Um, I mean, four out of six, I guess we're doing all right for now, but it'll be fine. They'll get their bikes in, and uh, we should be good to go come Monday morning. It's Cody Schaefer's with our bikes, so uh, should be here tomorrow morning. We're going to see what happens, and then uh, try to ride them tomorrow morning, and... Uh, yeah, we're definitely the last people I guess to eat to check in our bikes, but man, most importantly, we're racing, so uh, I'm pretty excited on that. Time resented. I spent it convincing myself the world's doing just fine. seven grand to get the three bikes across and we didn't want to pay that so uh, you know we uh, had to get all this paperwork they kept asking for we got on the paperwork Kawasaki helped out we had a ton of people from Arizona helping out and uh, we probably had like 20 people all together working on this project to get our three bikes and two parts crates across but uh, you know we got across with the $800 fine or $800 under the table to get across but most importantly we're racing so you know the tests are pretty awesome we've all walked them you know, the trophy team and some of the junior riders. We got six tests. We're going to do uh, four tests a day, which is doing it twice. And uh, it should be good. I mean, if it rains, it's going to be really, really slick. But right now, it's like riding on cement. It's so hard pack. And for me, that kind of suits my style. So, you know, that's going to be good for Timmy, I think, too. Yeah, it's uh, be pretty dusty, so I think the rain will be nice. And uh, you know, it's just nice to have our bikes and uh, be moving forward, hopefully get that behind us. Have a start week. For sure. So uh, today, Dastry and I, we went and walked some tests while the rest of the guys, uh, old Caselli and Jimmy Jared, Jared, not Jared anymore. And it's not Dastry either, it's Dastry. Okay. No, it's whatever I feel like calling you that day. And uh, the rest of the team, Brownie and uh, Woods. Woods, they tech their bikes today. They uh, worked on them first and then uh, went through tech, sound check, got their helmets checked in. Luckily that wasn't an issue because I heard it was going to be an issue. So, yeah. But our helmets are good. Tagger did an amazing job on our helmets. Thanks, Tagger. And, uh, you know, everything's moving forward now. As long as me and Dez get our bikes in, okay? Did, was that okay? That, that was name? good, Dez. Okay. I like sure. Right. That's good. Right. So, we got that. You were looking at that that way the whole time, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, I was looking at you too. Oh, okay. You're so sexy. Cool. Yeah, yeah, I know. <laughs> Lightning. Lightning. Okay. Lightning. I'm stroke. 
<laughs> and uh, Jimmy's hit by car. <laughs> so we're the walking wounded uh, trophy team this year. And for all of you that don't know, we're all vet riders on this team too. We're all 30 plus, Kurt. other than Kurt. Yeah. Captain Kurt is 27, but the rest of us are 30 plus riders here. So yeah, we got old we're holding it down for the old guys. It's the first time I'm not the old guy too, I like that. <laughs> Brownie ain't the oldest. Yeah, Brownie's the oldest. No, he's like 12, dude. Oh, he is like 12. Yeah, yeah we've been hanging around Brownie. He's definitely, uh, he's a class act for sure. He's, he's fun. Full he's, of energy. He's young at heart for sure. Definitely.